Hello, it's Celia. Um, I know it's been a while, but I've been kind of busy. Uh, May is a busy month. <laughs> and um, yeah, I don't have any excuses, to be honest. Uh, I've been busy and I have been kind of heavily attacked by allergies. So yeah, a little bit low on energy. Um, and because I haven't been making videos for quite some time, I so I was thinking about easing my way into doing videos again by making a weekend reads. But first, I would like to say welcome to all my new subscribers. Uh, welcome! I am so glad that you have found me. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoy what I'm making. <laughs> um, and I would also like to thank uh, Megan and Sue at the restricted section and Conrad for shouting me out. I really appreciate it. Um, yeah, thank you. So, as I said, I will do a weekend reads. Um, the reason I'm doing this on a Thursday is because I have four days off, so this is the start of the weekend for me. And um, the weekend is upcoming, at least. Um, I am quite in a reading slump at the moment. I haven't been reading a lot of books in May at all. I have been watching TV series instead. I have been watching The Handmaid's Tale and started um, Twin Peaks, The Return, this week, and um, yeah, it's storytelling though, so I have been enjoying that immensely, but I have been reading some books, and I have been reading French books, for example, I have been reading Nous and Me, or Nous et Moi, by Delphine de Vignon, and I will talk more about this on a later occasion, but it was it was a su surprise to me, and I really enjoyed it. Uh, it was kind of different from what I was thinking it would be, but in a good way. I have also been reading Colette, and I really can't believe why I haven't picked up Colette before, because she is really awesome. Uh, she is... I'm not sure how to describe her, but I read Gigi and really enjoyed that. And at the moment I'm reading The Cat. There are two novellas that are collected in this tiny little vintage book. And um, The Cat is about Allah and, and Camille and they are getting married. The only problem is that Allah has a cat. It's a Russian blue or something. And this cat is called Saha, and she is very possessive. And as a crazy cat person myself, I have been known to humanizing or my own cat, but Allah takes this crazy cat person to a whole new level. So I have just, I just want to say to Kami that you should run, don't marry him. And... Um, yeah, I'm really enjoying it so far, and um, yeah, obviously the cat is a symbol for something else, and uh, something more deep, and I will talk more about this in my wrap-up, but I really like Kami, no, no, I really like Colette's writing style, she's so lavish, and her language is so rich, and I feel like I'm a part of her stories, so yeah. I'm really glad I picked her up, finally. So on to the books I'm planning. And yeah, obviously I'm... I am planning on finishing this book today. And I would really like to continue my French binge. So I have picked up some French books that I will try to read this weekend. One book I might pick up is Straight is the Gate by André Gide. 
and this is a book about two young lovers and how religious obsession is making their relationship difficult. So this one, and I really like this old penguin edition, I think it's so cute. Another book I might pick up is Magritura uh, Moderato Cantabile or Moderato Cantabile. I'm not sure how to pronounce it, the title, but uh, this is a Norwegian translation. And I really love The Lover by her, so I'm excited to see or to read some of her other books. So, uh, the third book I might pick up is Irene Mirovsky and The Wine of Solitude. This is one of her earlier works. Um, I am really looking forward to see how she was as a young writer. I have so far only read Sweet Frances and that was her last work. So yeah, I'm curious to see. And um, this book has got really good praise. So. I have also a goal of reading more poetry and this upcoming weekend I will be reading Teaching My Mother How to Give Birth by Varsan Shire or Shire. I'm not sure how to pronounce her name. I am really sorry, I probably butchered it both times I guess, but this is the book and this is the author. And I have heard so many good things about this collection, both on booktube and other places. So I'm really looking for, <clears throat> I'm really looking forward to read it. Uh, I have been reading some of the poems, and they are really good. And last but not least, I might read a short story or two by Ernest Hemingway. I am slowly reading my way through his collected work or his complete short stories. I am I am really not that far in. I started reading this in Paris last summer. So the first short story I read back in uh, June, 21st of June 2016 in Paris. So this edition is pretty battered, but it's been a good companion when I'm out traveling. So yeah, I really like his writing in general. Um, and I have of course found, found my some favorites. So hopefully I will pick some of, pick it up. These are the books and stories I and poems that I will try to read this weekend and I will of course not manage to read all of them but maybe it's a goal, I'm not sure. Uh, if you have read some of them please let me know what you think of them and yeah please tell me what you will be reading this upcoming weekend as well. So 